today we are celebrating. We have more paperwork. Paperwork party, paperwork party. What is going on in here? Well. Well. Okay, so Good morning. Good morning, guys. We're laughing because that box right there is stuff to donate. And when we brought it out to the car with us, Peter put the camera in the giveaway box. I didn't mean to give you guys away. And I mean, then I, just, it was I an accident. said, oh, where's the camera? Did you put it in the giveaway box? And then he's like, I hope I didn't put it on the bumper of the car where I put my phone. <laughs> Thankfully, I, Mary asked me where my phone was when we got in the car, and I checked the bumper, and it was there. So, I just checked the giveaway box, and I found you in the giveaway box. Don't worry, we didn't get to the thrift store yet. <laughs> oh, man. What a day. What a day. We have more paperwork today, which is exciting. You know, each step of the adoption process, Oh, hey, if you haven't tuned in for a while, guess what? We We're are adopting. adopting a baby. We are in the process of adoption and each step of the process there, there's like initial paperwork and then there's more paperwork and each paper you get to fill out means that you are the next step of the process. And so today we are celebrating. We have more paperwork and we are so excited. Because I think <laughs> part of the process of adoption is waiting. Oh, um, yeah. But the other part is getting stuff done. Yeah. And so when we have things to get done, we're like, ah! we have something we can do. So <laughs> guess what? It's Friday night or it's Friday day right now. And tonight we're going to have a paper party. Woo! So we're gonna be filling out papers and we're gonna work on it probably round robin style. Like I'll fill out this part and he'll fill out that part and then we'll switch and fill it out. And yeah. So it'll be a fun date night. It will be. I got some work to do the rest of the afternoon. Yes. But we just picked up some newborn cloth diapers that somebody gave us. Ah! They're pretty cute. They're so cute. I mean, they're so tiny. I know. They're great. We'll see. So we, We're kind of like, if we're able to do cloth, cool. If we do disposables, cool. We'll see what happens. We're just like, cool. <laughs> cool. Cool, 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 cool. Guys, if you can't tell, I, kn I know that, uh, well, we've been catching you up over the last uh, week or so on all the happenings of the last month and a half but it's been exciting and joyful and if you can't tell we're excited already multiple times today we've started crying out of joy of like this is happening ah! yeah and from what I can tell from what you guys are sharing with us you guys are also crying tears of joy with us and that really really means a lot Thanks, guys. Okay, we're having tomato lunch. Peter's gonna have burrata tomato. These are our tomatoes from our garden. And arugula. These are the tomatoes I picked yesterday. And then the day before that, I picked about four or five ginormous tomatoes. And what we did was, I chopped up an onion and the tomatoes. <clears throat> and then later when it was dinner time, Peter used the onion and the tomatoes and made a pan sauteed sauce. It's really good. He realized it's kind of like tomato chutney or something. Basically we cook down the tomatoes with the onion and we do a little bit of sugar to cut the acidity and some oil, some oil, some spices, garlic, and it just makes like a the tomatoes kind of reduced down, but it's not like a pureed sauce. No. Oh, here, it's you kinda, can kind of see it. Yeah, here, let's give them a little Why shot of this. Why is it so this. dark in here? Probably because we don't have the lights on. Oh, that would be important. So this is what it kind of looks like. Leftovers? And it's 
delicious. <laughs> we really like it. We don't even take the skin off of the tomatoes, which traditionally you would do for a sauce. And we had that last night for dinner, <laughs> ravioli. Mary's having that. I'm having my tomato burrata. I gotta go edit the vlog. We'll see you guys later. Harry, you can't. Okay, Harry thinks that my hard drive is like something to snuggle with because I guess it kind of sounds like it's purring and it's blowing hot, wa hot air out the top of it. It's blowing hot water. This is real. Hard drive blows hot water. It's a liquid cooled hard drive. I'm, I'm kidding. Uh, but he's just like rubbing his face on my hard drive. Harry. Harry. How much fun are you having uh, editing oh, adoption man. videos? It's so fun because it's like, it's everything we wanted to vlog for the last month but haven't been able to. Well, and we so, vlogged it. Well, yes. And so it's all the footage that is actually substantial. It's going up. Yeah. We're having so much fun. All right, we're sitting down. Have paperwork party. Paperwork party. Paperwork party. <laughs> Alright, paperwork is complete for this stage of taking the next step. And the next step of our evening is we're having, what is this, orange chicken? Yeah, you made it, man. Can I say something about the take the next step? Okay. I love that we made that. So we have a line on our store. Yep. That's take the next step. And we made that before we started the adoption process, before we knew that we were heading into the adoption process. And I love how it applies to that and how it applies to everybody's life in whatever realm that is. If it's like, take the next step, get through this hour at work. Yeah. Or whatever it is. Or maybe you just had knee surgery and you're relearning to walk. Just take the next step. Or maybe you're hungry and you need to go make dinner. Take the next step. What is going on in here? Well. Well. Okay, so like, okay. Okay. We inherited quite a bit of baby stuff from my sister who yes. had a boy. Uh-huh. And, um, okay, well maybe we got some more boy stuff. But, um, <laughs> so we were given some baby clothes from friends and from my sister. So we do have some baby clothes. But... Just to be clear, we have no idea if we'll have a boy or girl. We have no idea. Yeah. And so, we will hopefully be listed as a waiting family starting next week. And possibly in like... A few days. A few days. So kind of like I'm feeling this need to... So like I have some diapers ready to go. I have a drill from putting the shelves up. Um, yeah, just, oh, yeah. I want to like get some things ready for if we're chosen quickly. Okay. We need to go quickly. Anyway. Plus, plus, it's just, you know, it's fun. It's super fun. So, this local place called Once Upon a Child, not sponsored, um, it is like a pre, what's it called? Like a consignment sale, I guess? It's a used It's a used store. Did you see it's the same company as Play It Again Sports? Really? Yeah. Interesting. So they buy baby clothes from people. When you're done with your baby clothes, you sell them to this place and then they sell them. Mm -hmm. Well, they had a sale. 25 onesies for $10. So 40 cents a piece. And we were like, well. Okay. okay. Because let's think of it this way. If we get half boy and half girl stuff, then it, whichever we don't use, it was only $5. So yeah. we're not wasting like, like a ton of money. Yeah. We so can give it to somebody else. Even if we only use half of them, it makes them only 80 cents a piece. Yes. So now I'm cutting the tags off and I'm going to show Peter his stomach was hurting really, really bad. Yeah. So that, that orange chicken did not agree with my stomach. And I remembered being in Trader Joe's and saying to Peter, didn't this make us like blazing sick last time we ate it? Well. I didn't get sick from I it. I should have listened. Anyway. Well, not necessarily. It was good to try it. It tasted good in the moment. It did taste good in the moment. 
Okay, so should I show you? Okay, ready? Yep. Okay. Oh, the cute lemon. I saw you pick that one out. Really? Yeah, that's so cute. Oh, does oh, that good. have a that's little newborn. little flower up top? Yeah. Oh. And it's like the sweet um fabric. Like, oh, oh yeah yeah yeah. And it has it's the like hand the thingies. Little yeah, that's sweet. Okay. Yeah. Mommy loves me. Oh, and that looks so similar to our I Choose Joy shirt. Oh yeah. That's funny. <gasps> Flamingos, I love it. Turns out I really like the Cloud Island from Target. Interesting. I kept picking things out. Nice. Oh, I love that. That's for an older, Yeah. I think it's 18 months, so boy or girl. Nice. I thought this could be boy or girl. Nice. Look at this one. Oh, is that a little dog? Yeah, newborn. That is so cute. That could be boy or girl. Yeah? Okay. Oh yeah, I thought you'd like this one. Oh, that's cute. This Aww. one's really soft. Newborn. Yeah, little stars. Yeah. Love it. <coughs> oh, man. You love Mickey Mouse. Okay, this one. Oh, we got, so we have a dog, an elephant. Nice. This one's just plain. Love it. Newborn. It's pretty versatile. Okay, this one's three months. Oh, a tag. So. That was pretty fun. You got to pick out 25 I onesies. Know, it was so fun. That was a cheap $10 date. Yes. That it was. made her very happy. Yes. Okay. That one's cute. Very cute. Hi, Harry. Oh, no, I see. Newborn. Nice. Okay. Cute. Oh, love that. Zero to three. I guess, actually, if our baby's really big, we might need a couple of that size. Let me see it. That's pretty cute. Really cute. Oh, that's labeled as newborn. That's huge. We can bring it. So I'll need to wash all these, and then we'll pack them up and get them ready. Oh, this is so cute. I'm a sucker for Baby Gap. Yeah. Like, <laughs> since my nephew was born, I've learned that I love shopping at Baby Gap. And this is a Baby Gap, that's why I said that. Isn't some, that cute? It's really cute. Alright. I mean, just a little pink onesie. Oh, Can you resist oh. that? Okay. Wait, what do we have here? It's like little flowers? Yep. Oh. Oh, I love this. Well, the camera died while we were getting that little haul of the onesies. Let me just tell you. They're super cute. And you want to see something else that's super cute? It's us. We barely ever print out pictures of ourselves. But we had this picture and we, we have one of these printers that we had it from, um, Mary and I bought it for like a photo booth that we were doing at our church up in Massachusetts and it will print pictures from your phone. And so we have a bunch of this like photo paper and so uh, Mary printed uh, this picture out and I really like it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it here by my desk in the working room. And we got a new scale for shipping. Let me see if I can show you this turn it on okay and then down here is the scale we retired the scale it has served us well for like five years and uh, now we upgraded to a much more efficient it's nice to have the separate display up above away from the scale anyways these are the exciting happenings in the working room while I wrap up some things for the night and uh, have I have I mentioned how much this big box of uh, what do you call it um, crinkle paper makes me laugh we use it to pack boxes 
like this one. That's a wrap on another day of excitement. And oh, the last few onesies that the camera died. I told them they were cute. They were cute. <laughs> <laughs> Take our word for it and stay tuned. Because we might be using them. <coughs> I'm just saying, in the future. We will be using them in the future. Yes. As always. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night, Poodle Noodle. Good night, Donut Dog. Donut Dog.